I'm actually filming a, another video. Got out of starting. Standing up straight. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So, who am I talking to? It's, Hello. It's Tim, the Viking. I think he's called Tim Outdoors now. I think I. Tim outside. Tim outside. Tim outside. Tim outside. But the Viking, as we all know him. Right. So, currently in uh, the village of Hone on Dartmoor this morning. And uh, else, come here. And uh, yes, I've not put up a video in absolutely ages. I think about 15 or 16 months. I've not been out that many times, maybe four or five camps in that time. And um, I've just lost the motivation for filming. So I'm challenging myself from now. I'm going to do one camp a month for the next 12 months. And I'm going to film every camp, hopefully. Um, and yes, yeah, so I'm out today on Dartmoor and I'm with Tim, which is good to see him because I've not seen him when we were saying back at the beginning of the year, wasn't it? Yeah, um, much, yeah. So uh, yeah, the plan today is we're gonna um, get onto the moors, head over to Holme Ridge and up towards Dartmeat and I think sort of Yard Tour, Sharp Tour and then head up to Mel Tour for a wild camp tonight. And then tomorrow it's just a short drop back into home, um, back to back to the cars. So yeah, um, take you along and uh, yeah, let's go. Coming over Holm Ridge now. There's a fair old steep climb up there, wasn't it, Tim? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Beast. Tim was gassing out, weren't you? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a little bit sleety. Um, it's not too cold, is it? No, it's mild. Yeah, well, it feels it. Feel, it does feel mild. Yeah. Um, but it's definitely a little bit of sleet coming down now we're up here. And we could be in for a little bit of snow, um, possibly, overnight. Um, but I think it's probably going to be more sleety rain. Just approaching Coombstone Tor now. Um, the sleet turned to snow for a bit, and then now it's turned to rain. So uh, yeah, we're all, we're all waterproofed up now. Um, yeah, so heading now towards um, dark meat now. Yeah, so we just, Dark Meat's just the other side of this river. And uh, I've never been here before, and Tim has, and, and according to the map, you could, you know, there was a crossing across here. I just assumed a clapper bridge of some sort, but as you can see, it's um, stepping stones all the way across, and <clears throat> yeah, me and Tim don't fancy, that's just dangerous. Not so much here, but over there, definitely. So, yeah. We've never been here before. We never knew that it was a stepping stone crossing. So, you know, unless you've been here before, you wouldn't know. So we're gonna have to um, 
rethink our plans and see uh, see where we're going to go. I don't know whether we're going to end up at Mel Tor now, but I'll come back. <laughs> He's got a smile on his face. <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah, we'll come back in a bit. Uh, what we did in the end, we ended up walking back up to Coombstone Tor, which is just over there. We were, we've, we, we, we've come from the other side of that. We've come back up, and uh, we didn't really want to pitch over there because it's yeah, a bit public car park there and whatnot. So we sort of headed over in this direction, and we just found a um, nice little spot here, a little flat spot. So. Uh, Tim's over in his acto over there. He's all happy, and uh, I'm pitched up the Jermid here, bivvying under this with the outkit bivvy tonight. Ellie's all wrapped up in a in a woof tub. She's got a Z light pad. I've just wrapped her up in a in my outkit quilt. Um, just for now, just until she, I've dried her off the best I can. But she's not the easiest dog to dry off when she's got her winter coat. Uh, yeah, so. Hopefully, it'll be nice and cosy in there tonight. And uh, the mist is rolled in. That's literally just rolled in because 10, 15 minutes ago, you could uh, you could see see for miles. I think it's just going to be sleety, snowy tonight. That's all it's done today. A bit of sleet, a bit of snow, a bit of rain. At the moment, it's raining. So I'm going to get out my waterproofs. Desperate for a cup of tea. Just got myself a nice coffee brewed up uh, using the Speedster um, and uh, the Upkit 650 mug. Uh, raining still, sleety rain. Dog's nice and cosy. <laughs> Bless her. Right, I shall probably um, not come back until the morning now. what you call breakfast in bed. Morning guys, just uh, just come up to 8 o'clock and uh, we're just packing up. Cold night last night, give you a little pan around. It's all, uh, I'm not sure if you better see but well in the distance there's snow right up on the top. We never had any here obviously but very icy. Just uh, yeah, white. Beautiful views though. Uh, yeah, it was um, it was a cold night. I woke up about just before midnight, and uh, I did cool off a bit, so I had a hot drink and uh, went back to sleep, and I was all right. Woke up at about 4.30 though, and I was uh, pretty much awake from then. I was just dozing, uh, but I never sleep that well anyway when I'm camping. Yeah, so I'll be back in uh, February for another episode. Um, yeah, and uh, I look forward to seeing you then. Cheers for watching, guys. May I stand unshaken? Yeah.